So let's bring it back home now. Elan Lyle Foundation has sponsored and provided a space for art projects, lectures, and seminars for years. It's up in Julian. The foundation's home was actually designated as a San Diego County historic site in 2008. Live in the studio today, we have executive director of the foundation, Marion Gertis, and current volunteer, Cristobal Gonzalez. They're both here to talk about their new fundraising campaign. Thanks so much for joining us, you guys. Thank Pleasure. You. I love hearing about this, uh, your foundation, um, but explain it to people, what, what you guys do, what it is. Well, first of all, we're talking about the home of artist James Hubble, James and Ann Hubble. Uh, James has had a long history in San Diego of making beautiful artworks. His home became renowned as people, because it's so unusual, as people came to visit and saw the organic shapes uh, and, and inspired building with nature, and so, uh, we have had many people, thousands of people visit us over the years and uh, now those buildings have, are getting uh, up in age, uh, built over 65 years and so uh, they're needing a little bit of love and attention and we are uh, doing a fundraiser. Uh, That's this what summer. we're looking at right That's now. Right. These, this is the buildings. These are those buildings, correct. The, the historic site. Built by James Hubble. That's right. up in and, Julian. And hundreds and thousands, actually thousands of people have visited us over the years. So, uh, and continue, can't continue to come and visit now, but we're doing some restoration on the, those spaces. This is so neat. All of these pictures, this is all up in Julian? There are 13 buildings on the property, all different all built at different times over 65 years so really special place and do you have a you have events up there because you have the workshops and we the have art workshops we have events we have tours it's beautiful uh, yes it is um, and so James and Ann Hubble they're well known in San Diego because their home is here original home is here in San they, Diego yes they're well known they because of that home but also for public art projects that Jim's been involved with uh, we, most notably Pacific Rim Park which is down okay. on Shelter Island and also Pacific Portal a beautiful sculpture so cool. that's right there on the island as well Cristobal you're a volunteer what do you do as a volunteer so I got involved with uh, Ilan Lael and James when I was actually st studying architecture back in Tijuana oh. and I knew about his work because uh, he also has a lot of work in La Esperanza Kindergarten with uh, there in Tijuana. So I was studying architecture and being volunteer there on the weekends. And then the Pacific Rim Park uh, in Shelter Islands uh, happened in 98. So the school uh, invited me, and so that's how I, I got involved. But it's, I mean, working with James and Ilan Lael is a very unique ex experience because so. you you are you 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 are a fountain of creation when, when do, being around James energy. So it's just very unique experience. You are in touch with creating with stone, with tile, steel. So it's a very special energy and doesn't matter if you have experience in it or done or, or you don't it's just like somehow it just boom comes out of you I <laughs> so I mean those are not just little square rectangular buildings at yes. all I mean you don't mm. usually see buildings with curves on them <laughs> uh, listen before we go I want you to tell us about the fundraising campaign so that these buildings stay nice for everybody to Correct. enjoy that's right so we are in the process of raising eighty thousand dollars from the community uh, and we're about 65% of the way there. That program is called the Summer of Love Campaign. Uh, you can find it on our website and uh, we encourage people who care about Jim's work, who enjoy his art, to, to give us uh, you know, a, a little bit of help and to let us help us show some love to those buildings and keep them intact for generations to come. For people to come and be inspired that up in right. Julian. Guys, thanks so much for joining us. We really appreciate it. We'll make sure we put a link to that on our website at cbs8.com. Thanks guys, we'll be right back after the break.